the very important person that Kate Middleton talks to every day in the midst of recovery. Kate Middleton continues to recuperate in the seclusion of Adelaide Cottage, a refuge where she feels the full support of her family and close friends. Ever since the British Royal House announced the abdominal surgery of Kate Middleton, there has not been a day when the Princess of Wales did not appear in the news. The silence surrounding her evolution caused great concern, which generated a stream of unprecedented speculations. It is officially known that Kate's condition is optimal and she is currently recovering in her home in the cottage in Adelaide with her husband and three children. Days of rest and separation, during which she reads, walks through the Windsor Gardens, enjoys time with George, Charlotte and Louise. But not only that, as a source close to the Princess of Wales told the British newspaper Daily Mail, she has already started working online to organize her agenda for the coming months. Her family and closest friends have become her unconditional support, but there is one person who is especially present in Kate Middleton's daily life. According to royal expert Angela Levin, although she is away from the public eye, there is one person she talks to every day. I think he will want to talk to his sister Pippa every day and find out how each member of his family is doing, he told The Sun. In the article, Levin assures that the relationship between Kate and Pippa is very special. He fully trusts her and can freely talk about his problems. This relationship extends to Carol, his mother. These statements confirm that, although they always try to stay in the shadows, Kate needs her family very close in these delicate moments. Prince William devoted himself to caring for Kate Middleton. Kate's surgery forced Guillermo to make an unprecedented decision paralyzing his institutional obligations to be with his wife. He himself stated this in a statement, which received the support of all Britons. Unfortunately, Carlos III's cancer disrupted his plans, and he had to return to public life sooner than expected. This is a difficult decision, considering that a few days ago, he emphasized that his priority was his wife and family. Kate is very busy, and, as the aforementioned publication Angela Levin assures, knowing that he is by her side and having time to talk is a great encouragement for her. Loud statement from the Royal House about Kate Middleton's health, the mystery surrounding Kate Middleton's health spawned countless theories about her illness. The concern of the Britons for the Princess of Wales grows every day, and this forced the Royal House to make a statement at the last minute, making it clear that Kate is fine and there is no reason to worry. From the very beginning, it was absolutely clear to us that the Princess of Wales would be absent until Easter and Kensington Palace would provide updated information only when something was important, says the expressive text in which a certain fatigue is felt on the part of the institution. Thus, we will have to wait another month to see Kate Middleton again in public life. Anxiety in Buckingham, the true state of Kate Middleton's health becomes known after several weeks of secrecy, the absence of Prince William in Windsor caused concern for his wife Kate Middleton. The last-minute absence of Prince William at the Memorial Mass in honor of Constantine of Greece in Windsor due to personal problems caused anxiety about the deterioration of Kate Middleton's health. This prompted Kensington Palace to reassure the Britons and report the latest news about the Princess of Wales. While the religious service was held in Street George's Cathedral with Camilla Parker as the perfect hostess, the royal family reported that Kate Middleton was healthy and her progress was going as expected. He is still fine, said a representative of the Crown to People magazine. Without going into details, the statements of the palace suggest that Guillermo's decision has nothing to do with his wife. Prince William apologized to the Greek royal family this is not the first time that William abandons the Greek royal family. Recall, the Princes of Wales also did not go to Athens in January 2023 for the funeral of King Constantine. Instead, Princess Anne attended the event as a representative of the British royal family. Today, Guillermo justified his absence for personal reasons, the origin of which is unknown. In fact, it is not expected to resume his official agenda for a week. In addition to the last-minute absence of Prince William, the absence of King Charles III was already confirmed earlier, 
as he remains in the shelter after being diagnosed with cancer. In any case, Constantine of Greece had very good relations with the British family, as he was a very good friend of the monarch and even was chosen as one of the godparents of William. Aware of his role, William did not hesitate to contact the Greek royal family by phone and apologize, a gesture that was welcomed by both Queen Anne Maria and her son Paul. The relations between the two lines were very good for decades. It should be remembered that Charles III chose Constantine himself as one of the godfathers of his son William, so his presence at this mass had an even more special weight. To the absence of William, we must add the absence of King Charles III. It was initially assumed that the monarch would receive his guests in the seclusion of Windsor Castle, but in the end this did not happen. As reported by the British press, Charles III left his home early in the morning unnoticed, and this means that he had no opportunity to greet the members of various royal houses who moved to the United Kingdom for this solemn event. This is the daily life of Kate Middleton after abdominal surgery on January 16. Kate Middleton underwent a delicate abdominal surgery, and since then the information about the Princess of Wales has been very limited, and the silence about the state of her health causes concern among the British. After discharge, Kate settled in the cottage in Adelaide with her three children, George, Charlotte and Louis. The first few days he remained almost motionless on the bed in his bedroom. Under the round-the-clock care of two nurses, she gradually gained mobility. Now he devotes his time to reading, walking through the Windsor Gardens and communicating with the kids, which is his real medicine. Her development a month after the surgery is so positive that Kate started working from home, as already reported by various British media. Moreover, according to the time, he will make different decisions to define his role in the English royal family. As reported by the aforementioned British media, the Princess of Wales intended to update her working team, appointing Colonel Tom White as her right hand, thus following in the footsteps of the late Elizabeth I, whom she accompanied to the deathbed. If everything goes well, Kate Middleton will return to public life in April of next year. This was reported by the British Royal House in one of its latest statements. Of course, at least for now, it is not specified when and how this will be, but the expectations from this first image are maximum.